I get so much feedback on Twitter. And the other day I was asked, is there a quickie for doing horses? Well, I'll go one better than that. Um, a person on horseback. Here we go. If you do a person, all you need to do is the horse's head and a few shoulders. Look. There's, there we go. Like so. And now we'll have a person. Quick drawing. shoulders of the horse and now like so bit of knobbly knees <laughs> and a little bit down there we'll have that sort of so and here's another one in the back tail easy isn't it what a simple going now just to color it in we'll have a little bit of black I've got a palette somewhere here I have a little bit of black which of course ultramarine blue and burnt sienna mixed don't use manufactured black there's a bit of that using my number eight round brush for this. A little bit there. Now flesh tone. Flesh tone is so easy to mix. Charles Evans sand. There you go. Sorry, phone's all over the place here. I'm trying to hold the phone and with one hand and paint with the other. Here's a bit of light red. Have more sand in it if you want a lighter flesh tone. There you go. There, there, and there. Now I'll have a little bit of red, lizard and crimson. And again, fill in there. Now I'll leave a little bit of white for the shirt. Come down like so. And carefully around the horse's head. Now a little bit of black again. For those boots. And a foot. And another one here. Now brown. I'll have some raw umber. Raw umber, of course, the only brown I use. Raw umber and a touch of blue. And just fill it. Fill in the horse. Bit there, bit there. Leaving with a white face. It's really difficult to try and paint something like this and look through the phone rather than look at the painting. A little bit here. And kind of carefully around his head though. Now fill it. And a little bit under his chest. Like I say, the brush I'm using, number eight round, Aquafine. Students call it brushes these, but they carry so much water. Aquafine number eight round. 
Now, a little bit more water into that same brush full of paint to make that weaker there. Not quite that weak. And weaker there. Now, a little bit of blue into my brown. So I've made it darker. And the tail. A little bit of blue again, just blue. Put a bit of shadow in there. And there. Now again, back to black. Put a little bit of shadow. So that side of his head and underneath there, look. A bit under his chest. And there you go. Somebody riding a horse. Isn't that simple? Not too much fiddling about. Ta -da. Like I said, Aquafine brushes, Aquafine paper, uh, Aquafine uh, paint, sorry. The paper I'm using is actually the Langton Rough. It's only 140 pound weight and I never mess about with it. And as I said, with the books, the best ones for the tips and techniques, this one is the Charles Evans Pocketbook for watercolour artists. Full of stuff. There are some horses in here, how to paint horses as a stage by stage. Um, can't find it right now, but it's all going on in that book. So, see you soon. Bye.